Unto the End is a game that I saw as a trailer a few years ago, then again on the Escapist Indie Showcase a few months ago. While the real game is far from the trailer, I'm not here to judge it on the talk of its big dick. I'm here to latex my hand and inspect on what it can show me. So here's my review on Unto the End. Unto the End takes place in the middle of winter in some random mountains, and if they aren't random then I don't know where we are, because the game has little elements of story to help you know where you are. However, for the lack of story, the game makes it up to you in combat, and boy oh boy is this game hard as shit. Thank goodness this game was as short as it was, because it took me a total of around 4.5 hours on my first playthrough, and while I was surprised on how short of a game this is, I was relieved to find out that I had finished the game. Because I wrote down in my sticky notes while playing this game my whole experience before getting into the endgame boss fight. What did I write down you may ask? Well, I wrote down a single word, that word being fuck. The reasoning for writing the word fuck is because this game is Einstein's definition of insanity. Doing something over and over again and expecting different results. While different results were achieved, getting into new fights would just feel exhausting to get that black screen and walk back to the monster that's been killing you for no joke a solid 10 minutes. Like, fuck! The combat is extremely well thought out and is my favorite part of the game, allowing the player to swing low, high, duck, shoulder check, throw, roll, counter, faint high or low, knock off balance, and your own reaction time as a crutch to keep you from dying. Replayability wise, it's somewhat replayable if you like to torture yourself. I replayed it twice so I could get a better understanding of the game, but if I wasn't doing a review on this game, I would have played it once and been done with it. Not because I think this game is bad, it's just the payoff being underwhelming for how difficult the game is. The music here is ambient cave sounds to study with, and combat music sprinkled in when you get into fights. Pair the music in with the art sound, heavy breathing with grunts that this Highlander looking motherfucker makes, and ooh, is this game atmospheric as fuck. She, I'ma need a jacket, I feel so cold. Unto the End is an experience, not a good or bad one, but not good enough to recommend. While the combat is great, the game could have gone somewhere further in enemy variations, environments, weapon varieties, puzzles, and especially the endgame boss fight. Because I didn't even know the endgame boss fight was an endgame boss fight until I finished the game. If you like to play hard as shit games, then this is definitely for you. And, as a bonus, when you beat the game twice on the third playthrough, you get one shot and have to start all the way from the beginning. So... Yeah! Overall, the game in my opinion is a 5 out of 10. Some may like it, but others won't. Again, it depends on how much you like hard as shit games.